But I'd now like to introduce our other guest with us today, Mr. Scott Kelly. So he is an engineer, he's a retired American astronaut, and a retired US Navy captain. And in October 2015, he set the record for the total accumulated number of days spent in space by an American astronaut, which is 520 days. So I'll turn it over to Mr. Scott Kelly for some initial remarks. Yeah, so when you're, when you're in space and you consider the fact that all seven and a half billion people, with the exception of you and your crewmates, are right down there below, 250 miles below, as you're flying around at 17,500 miles an hour, everyone who's ever existed, everyone who's lived and died, uh, nearly everything that has ever happened in our uh, human existence has happened right there. When we're in space, we don't see political borders. You know, at night you might see certain borders. Certainly the DMZ between North and South Korea is very noticeable. But during the daytime, you know, you don't see countries. You see continents. You see a planet Earth that we are all a part of, all in this together and how we need to work together to solve our collective problems. Sometime during the beginning part of my, my year in space was at a time when there was a lot of news about the you know, ref refugees in Syria and the Middle East and North Africa um, trying to get to Europe. And you'd see on the news you know, the kids washing up on the, on the shore. Um, and at the very same time, we had these beautiful passes flights over the Mediterranean and just seeing, you know, the, how that region from space is just so incredibly beautiful. And then you consider, you know, what is happening down there and it just does not make sense. So this orbital perspective is something that we as astronauts have the privilege, privilege to experience. And if we could give that experience to everyone else on Earth, I think we would have a, have a better planet. 